वेलकम टू अपना मेरिट फैमिली प्रैक्टिस स्पेशलिटी रोटेशन मेरा नाम दानिश भट्टी है आई एम अ मूवमेंट डिसऑर्डर्स न्यूरोलॉजिस्ट अ फैकल्टी एट यूनिवर्सिटी ऑफ नेब्रास्का मेडिकल सेंटर इन ओमहा नेब्रास्का इस प्रोग्राम का मकसद स्पेशलिस्ट की अप्रोच जैसे न्यूरोलॉजिस्ट कार्डियोलॉजिस्ट सकाइट्रिस्ट दूसरे स्पेशलिस्ट हैं वो आपके साथ शेयर की जा सके कि वट वुड वी वॉन्ट यू टू थिंक अबाउट पेशेंट्स वन यू सी इन योर प्रैक्टिस हम क्या चाहेंगे कि आप किस तरह सोचें पेशेंट्स के बारे में हम किस तरह सोचते हैं कैसे वर्कअप करते हैं ऑन कॉमन डिजीज दैट यू सी इन योर डेली प्रैक्टिस दिस इज़ अ वेरी प्रैक्टिकल हैंड्स ऑन प्रोग्राम इट्स अ वेरी इंटरेक्टिव प्रोग्राम हम आपके साथ कोलेबरेट करना चाहते हैं आपके साथ पार्टनर करना चाहते हैं टू एम्पावर यू इन टेकिंग केयर ऑफ योर पेशेंट्स बेटर वी हैव लाइव सेशन्स विद इंटरेक्शन्स विद पैनलिस्ट डिस्कसिंग various perspective we have experts and primary care physicians from pakistan on the panel and pakistani diaspora from from abroad on the panel discussing with each other this is this is an exciting program because it's a collaboration between so many wonderful pakistani diaspora organizations and pakistani organization i'm really really thankful to national family medicine committee uh, and uh, my co director professor nasir shah representing it uh, and our liaison to government uh dr jalil khan uh, i'm really thankful to them in supporting this and many many family medicine experts who are part of this project as well as the part- partner organizations in this project which are the australian association aap and uk organizations apne and apsuk uh, and of course we are apna merit which are association of pakistani physician descent in north america thank you hi my name is yusuf i'm a gp in australia I'm also one of the co-directors of the Apna Merit Family Medicine Subspecialty Rotation Program. I welcome you all to this program. It give you an opportunity to learn from the world leaders in this program who can teach about different specialties. These specialties which will be covered in this program include cardiology, nephrology, pediatrics, psychiatry, neurology, emergency medicine, uh as well as infectious disease and gastroenterology later on there will be other sub specialties which we added as part of this program especially based on your feedback the program will be uh, adjusted accordingly i welcome you to the family medicine program assalamu alaikum everyone i am one of the course co director of this program dr mariam ghaffar and i'll be talking about some of the activities which you will be doing in between your live sessions or webinars so these activities we call it as asynchronous discussions or you can call it as reinforcement activities what are the benefits of it so we want to make sure that whatever you are learning in your classrooms or live sessions you are able to digest that properly and for that we have designed it in like we are using different tools which will be in built in your lms or the links will be posted in your lms and you will be using it just to show that whatever you have or you're going to reflect whatever you have learned in your classroom now what are the benefits of this so the benefit is one of the biggest benefit is that you are getting cme hours for that but we have seen that in past that students when they do these kind of activities so it builds more confidence it basically enhances their learning i am just going to show you uh, one of my screen here where i'm using one of the tool which i mentioned like genuinely so look at how interactive this is if whatever like I'm, i was telling you about the benefits so you can see here that this is like the reflection and tools like we not just generally padlet idea boards kahoot google docs so there will be a lot of tools we'll be using grading this will be done by your faculty mostly and then some of it will be peer to peer grading how much efforts you need to put for this hardly 2 to 3 hours so not that much effort and you are getting additional cme credits for that so wish you best of luck and hope to see you soon in our live sessions assalam alaikum the family medicine rotation program which is being planned by apna from usa apne from europe and aap from australia is excellent in many ways uh, on one hand it is a capacity building uh, cme program for our family physicians and on the other hand it also strengthens the efforts of the existing faculty members of family medicine in pakistan and i also believe that this uh, rotation program will build the image of family medicine at higher levels i mean pakistan medical and dental council 
Higher Education Commission of Pakistan and Federal Ministry of Health and possibly the Provincial Ministries of Health. And the program has been designed in the form of rotations which simulate family medicine residency. And we are starting with cardiology and cardiology and uh, we congratulate the whole team for uh, conceptualizing this and implementing this and uh, our best wishes and prayers are with the whole team and with the program and we hope with time we'll keep on adding rotations and a time will come when we will have cover the entire spectrum of family medicine rotations uh, and to make it a very big program for our family physicians. Thank you. Hi, uh, my name is Dr. Abdul Jalil Khan. I'm an assistant professor of family medicine at Khyber Medical University, Peshawar, Pakistan. I'm going to talk about the selection criteria for Apna Merit Specialty Clinical Rotation Program. As you are aware, anybody can attend our online webinar. However, there is a strict selection criteria for those who wants to complete the full clinical rotation, which will also award them an accredited CMEs. About 50 candidates will be selected from across Pakistan. Preference will be given to those candidates who are already working in primary health care, either in public sector or as private GPs, and they have completed a short course in family medicine, either certificate, diploma, or in process of completing their membership in family medicine. Those candidates will be required to complete the full clinical rotation along with the reinforcement activities and the compulsory assignments and after completion they will be awarded an accredited CME. Thank you. You will interact with colleagues from UK, Europe, from organizations such as APNI, IPPA and APPS UK. We will have the chance to learn from your difficulties and share with you best practices so that we can have a mutually beneficial long-term learning relationship.